A fire in a farmhouse caused a northeast family of six to lose their home and contents this morning. Tonight, the community is reaching out to help them rebuild their lives. Erie News Now, Lisa Adams is joining us here in studio after talking with the fire chief and fire officials about what happened. And Lisa, also, who is reaching out to help? This is a pretty young family. Did they get out okay? Good evening, Eva. They are a young family. The fire broke out in the home you can see here behind me in Northeast, the home of Ken and Veronica Bartlett about 940 this morning. We've learned they have three sons, ages 7, 9, and 11, and a two-month-old baby girl. Fire officials tell us everyone but dad was home this morning, and thankfully, they all escaped unharmed. Firefighters got the call to 8780 Smith Road in Northeast about 940 this morning and found the Bartlett's two story farmhouse already heavily involved in fire. The first crews from Fuller and Crescent Hose Company quickly attacked the blaze, but it had a good head start. They knew they needed more firefighters from neighboring departments and more water too, so a lot more tanker trucks came in to assist. Now at one point, firefighters had to evacuate because the home was actually collapsing. The important thing again is that all the family escaped to safety and no firefighters were hurt during the firefight. Uh, units arrived on location reporting a working fire with heavy fire involvement and additional companies were called from Cool Hose, Edinburgh, um, Ripley, Fairfield and Harbor Creek. And do you happen to know what caused the fire? Uh, at this point, it looks like it was a electrical appliance malfunction, um, but it is still undetermined at this point. Yeah, the chief, I understand, is calling the fire cause accidental and electrical. The Red Cross has confirmed they are helping the family with urgent needs. We're talking housing, financial assistance, and any health, medical, or kids' supplies. But we're told they did not have homeowners insurance. We've also learned there is a Rebuild the Bartlett's GoFundMe page almost halfway already to a $5,000 fundraising goal, goal. And the Greenfield Baptist Church and 4-9 Thrift Store in Northeast are also helping the family out as well. Live in the studio, Lisa Adams, Erie News Now.